Hey guys, I'm on location in downtown Mount Holly on the northwest side of Charlotte, looking at a fire station right off of Main Street. A lot of beautiful trees back here. It's an established neighborhood. Because it's raining, I'm not starting out in front, but here we are. We've got James Hardy and Board and Batten siding. It's Hardy Board, and this is a 0.44 acre lot. It's definitely infill, meaning that they found a lot, probably tore down an existing house and there's another brand new house right next to it. Again, on an established street, you will have the nicest house in the neighborhood, there's no doubt. So again, Craftsman styling even on the front door. You come in, this is a four bedroom, two and a half bath house. Take my shoes off and basically come in and you've got this open concept. You know, this reminds me of the last house I lived in in Indianapolis, square footage almost the same. You know, you think about the casing around the windows, for instance. There are a lot of new construction homes that they are wrapped with drywall and you don't see any wood. And then even here, we're seeing this broad, generous baseboard. Shot another house like this the other day by the same builder, uh, priced it the same, 420. You know, my heart has really gone out for that first time home buyer. People that are trying to buy and yet they got squeezed out of the market with all the price increases and it seems like gouging really from the builder so you've got really nice finishes here it looks like three centimeter quartz rectangular undermount sink good sized cabinets clean and if you're a subscriber to my channel you know i'm a sucker for a window over the sink and if you don't know that go ahead and subscribe and take care of business guys give me a call never reach out to the builder or to the listing agent because they have the best interests of the seller at hand but what i'll tell you this is the Second house I've been in from this builder this week. Uh, infill, they're filling a real niche here, priced at 420. Beautiful deck with lots of trees. Why? Because it's an established neighborhood. And when that greens up, it'd be amazing. You know, if you're like me and you like small towns, living right, I mean, off of Main Street in downtown Mount Holly, that's money, baby. And this house is ready for a quick move. I can just tell you, because I'm in houses all the time, seeing little things like a thick, I need some stain, but that's easy. Uh, a nice thick handrail rather than the little cheap ones, that impresses me. In other words, they, they could have spared a, a few bucks there in the, in the materials, but they didn't. So you got a little bump out here, and this is your front window. So you've got control of your environment. You know, even things like ceiling fans, this is the primary bathroom. It's got an ensuite bath, a bedroom rather. And so again, you've got nice quartz. And again, they went all the way up with that, which is classy. They didn't have to do that. Would have been a lot less expensive to just put in a, 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 one of those units that just sits there. Good size closet already. Got plenty of wire shelves. Again, windows everywhere. This is great, guys. Let's look out this side window. See how that lot goes all the way over? Looks like maybe a creek there is where the water is running back because we're a bit on a hill They're coming down from Main Street there. So primary suite on the main level, and then just to keep it everything in your mind, you've got a kitchen around there to the right. Now we start with carpet, and as requested, took off my shoes. Let's just say that you are uh, working remotely. You got that primary bedroom downstairs. Up here, you've got one bath upstairs for three bedrooms linen closet and uh, so let's just take these bedrooms one at a time now that doesn't mean that you have to uh, have people occupying each bedroom you know that you could literally have this as a storage room this is a good size room uh, second bedroom upstairs is up in front that would be ideal to me for uh, uh, working remotely because you've got your desk you know sitting right here let's say and you can look right out your window and again control your environment so guys, I would welcome you to give me a call. Never call the builder or the seller uh, because they have the best interests of the seller in mind, but you want to give me a call at 704-345-3400. They've already got the price of our professional fee built into the price of the home, which again, I said is 420 as of the, this shooting. And uh, so for you to not call a buyer agent means that you're already paying for a service uh, that you are not going to take advantage of. So now you've got, again, a good size laundry room with a window. And I was kind of surprised by this space right here. This is a really deep 
closet. So what I see there is you've got room for maybe winter storage and uh, other things, boxes, totes, etc. So guys, give me a call, 704-345-3400. My team of buyer agents would love to be your buyer agent and help you in this or another transaction. So I'm looking for your call. Hit subscribe if I've helped you. I think I have. And couple that with a phone call at 704-345-3400. And I'll see you in the next video.